Hello everyone, this is Parrish. Today is Sunday, March 4th, 2012, time, 8.27 a.m. This video is about a dream which was given to me on February 29th, 2012. In this dream, I found myself walking down Fulton Street and I stopped at the corner of Fulton Street and J Street which is located in downtown Brooklyn it was daytime I believe it may have been spring or summertime as well I assume I was wearing a shirt and a pair of slacks inside this dream I was not wearing a jacket just a shirt and a pair of jeans and I believe a pair of sneakers or shoes um, downtown Brooklyn also was empty I just seen myself standing on the corner of Fulton Street and J Street uh, I picked up that this area was abandoned for some reason. I also noticed that all the stores were closed. More or less this area was like a ghost town. Then I looked all the way down J Street, more or less I believe towards the south or the southern sky and I seen buildings in the distance and after I took notice of the buildings in the distance I looked up into the heavens and I beheld strange looking rectangular cloud like objects in the sky they looked as if a cat had scratched the sky um, I knew that these things were not chemtrails they were this weird looking long rectangular like clouds or whatever they were hanging out in the sky. I noticed that the inner part of this, uh, the, the strange looking clouds, uncanny clouds, uh, had a string in the middle of it. The string was an uh, orange or reddish color and outer layers of the clouds displayed a light blue ruffle and there were many of these things in the sky I will pan back the camera so you can get a better look of what I've drawn Okay, after this, I found myself still in Brooklyn, but this time around, I was in the East New York section of Brooklyn, a part of Brooklyn where I grew up in. And in this dream, I see my father driving a car, and the car he was driving was very gray, like a dirty gray color. I've never seen a car like this before, plus this car was quite old, it like came from the 70's I think it was a four door car and it had like fins on the back of it like an old you know uh, 70 TV show uh, Batman and Batman drove a car and it just, the car back part or rear end had like fins well this is a car that my father was driving it was great and I kinda picked up that it was this color because of maybe a volcano cloud have came over New York City and it dumped a lot of volcanic ash upon the car and I guess the ground and before I left this dream I decided just to look around and once again I looked up in the sky and I seen the same type of cat like scratches in the air and they were the same color that I uh, witness in the rectangular scratch-like clouds uh, that hovered over 
downtown Brooklyn. I will pan back this camera so you can get a better look of what I've drawn. Okay, and once again, I must state that these things I seen in the air were not chemtrails. They appear to be different. Um, this uncanny, weird. Um, I was not afraid of these things. I was just curious as to what they were. Then I woke in from this dream. Thank you for sharing your time and watching my video. And everyone have a great day. Take care. Hello everyone, this is Paris. Today is Sunday, April 29th, 2012, at time 8.22 a.m. This quick video is about a dream which was given to me yesterday on April 28th, 2012. In this dream, I found myself inside an American city. It was daytime. I may have been in Brooklyn, New York. Then after I guess where I might have been inside this dream, I felt I needed to look up into the sky, and when I did look up into the heavens, I saw weird looking clouds. The clouds I saw in my dream were rectangular in shape, and they were moving slowly across the heavens. Uh, let me pan back this camera so maybe everyone can get a better look at my drawing um, two months ago I had a dream of similar clouds which I made a video about this particular dream and this dream is in my YouTube channel called yes okay it's me for now, in this dream, the clouds were similar to this one, but um, the clouds here were mostly white, and they were moving. In this dream, two months ago, the clouds had some color in it, a bit of color in it, blue, orange, and... Um, they did not appear to move inside this dream. Uh, in this dream, I knew exactly where I was. I was downtown Brooklyn, New York, and I'm looking down J Street, which is um, downtown Brooklyn. And before I left this particular dream that I had two months ago, I found myself in East New York section of Brooklyn. And... I beheld the same weird looking colorful clouds. Now, in this new dream, the clouds, of course, like I mentioned earlier, were moving slowly across the heavens. And before I left this dream, this particular dream, I found myself holding a glass, a very tall glass, and this glass had gray ashes in it, and I picked up that the gray ashes that were inside this glass came from a volcano explosion. That the ashes were volcanic ash. And in this dream I had two months ago, I believe I mentioned something about a volcano or some type of gray volcanic ash upon a old style car. Um, this old style car was saturated with some type of gray particle upon it. it was 
it it was not a normal looking car um, everyone you know maybe you should guys should take a look at this particular dream that I had two months ago uh, I have mentioned several times in my dreams which I posted it uh, my dream about a volcano going off somewhere on this planet and that the Brooklynites people here in Brooklyn will be affected by the volcanic ash that, will, that people in Brooklyn will see over Brooklyn, New York. Um, I know that a lot of my dreams come from God and a lot of my dreams have came to pass and most of them are showing signs of coming to pass. Uh, before I leave this video, I just want everyone to know that um, I truly believe we are living in the end times and God is God and like the Bible say, God takes no pleasure in the destruction of the wicked. We all need to come to the Lord, to our Creator, the one who made us. We need to be right with the Creator. Okay everyone, thank you for watching this short video. And everyone have a fantastic day. Take care.